Martin Keane names two defenders Arsenal could have signed instead of Ben White. Arsenal legend Martin Keown has questioned his old club's recruitment strategy after watching new pounds 50 million signing Ben White struggle on his competitive debut for the Gunners in last night's 2-0 defeat against Brentford. Starting alongside Pablo Mary in a new look back four, the England international struggled to deal with the physical threat offered by Ivan Tony, highlighted by the fact he lost a worrying 50% of his aerial duels. White fared little better on the deck and was fortunate that Brian Bumo dragged his shot wide after the Brentford forward had waltzed around the former Brighton defender shortly after Sergi Kanos had given the bees a deserved lead. Kean is hopeful that White's debut merely represents an early setback but fears Arsenal still lack the dominant leader their backline appears to be crying out for. Manchester United and Liverpool have strengthened their defences this summer with the likes of Rafael Varane and Ibrahim Konate, but Kean believes there were other bargains to be had in season Premier League defenders who have joined the likes of Leicester and Crystal Palace in the close season. He told Stadia Mastro, what Arsenal need is people who can defend. You look at it now, and Vestergaard was available, and he's on his way to Leicester. He's 6 feet 4 or 6 feet 5, and I'm pretty certain he'd be dealing with those balls coming into the box, so recruitment is all important. There were other central defenders available, at £50 million he could still probably prove to be a good signing, but you've got the likes of Anderson signing for Palace. So, you take your chances. Of course the manager is part of that, and you're then hoping they are going to put the performances in, and you need a central defender for all occasions and tonight that showed a glaring weakness in Ben White's game. But that can be worked on, you can improve that area, you can nudge the striker there's all sorts of things you can do to improve that, but that needs to come from the manager the coaches to improve the players. Arsenal have spent nearly £275 million since Arsene Wenger's departure, and, in general, Kean believes much of that has been wasted on players who aren't equipped to deal with the rigours of Premier League football, and fears it will be left to a crop of emerging youngsters to drag their club out of a miserable situation. He added, recruitment it's glaring, when you look at Pepe and the money they've spent, and you're looking for a performance. It's not about marquee signing or making a statement with what you spend, it's who you buy, and then how they perform. Roy Keane and Carragher slam stupid Arsenal chief Edu for signing Chelsea rejects Arsenal willing to listen to offers for Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang buzzing Joe Willock explains decision to leave Arsenal for Newcastle United I think Party has been one of the best signings they've made, I like Gabriel as a central defender, but Party can't stay fit, and he's been a disappointment. When you look at the recruitment, and who has been bought it's not going well. But the team needs to regroup and respond in a calm way, and come back fighting. But it's going to be the young players that the club look to because they are the future of the club, Saka and Smith Rowe, but they need support. They need Lacazette and Aubameyang to be well and join the group very quickly. More Mikel Arteta issues apology to Arsenal fans after opening day defeat to Brentford more Jamie Carrer identifies real problem position for Arsenal after Brentford defeat for more stories like this, check our sport page follow Metro Sport across our social channels.